Hey y'all, welcome back to Georgia Cooking for Soul. Today I'm gonna be making some scalloped potatoes. Over here in this strainer, I have my potatoes peeled, sliced, and I also cook them for about five, six, seven minutes so they can get get tender because I don't I don't want to put them in the uh, oven raw because I was scared they may not cook done all the way through. But right now, in this in here, I have some butter, about two tablespoons of butter. I'm going to mix up a little sauce. I'm going to add some, a cup of milk. I'm going to add some garlic. Hold on one second, see when I put that all in here. Okay. I'm gonna add maybe like a teaspoon of garlic. I'm going to use a tablespoon of measure. That's because I'm going to put in a tablespoon of flour. And some salt and pepper. Turn up the heat. Add my potatoes. I know some of them they tore overcooked, but I'd rather have them overcooked than undercooked. So that's why I that's why I cook them like this. Okay, afternoon. 
spread this mixture here over it. Then you want to top it with whatever kind of cheese you want. Whatever kind you like. Cook your potatoes, you don't have to, but I do. I put mine. Okay, now I'm gonna add cheese on top. I'm gonna put it in a because my potatoes are already done. I'm just gonna put, I'm gonna put mine in a 375 degree oven until my cheese melts on top, and then it'll be ready. But if you got you use the raw potatoes, you're gonna have to cook yours on 375. And you're gonna have to uh Let it cook, let it cook until your potatoes are done. And you're probably gonna need two cups of milk instead of one. So you can have more sauce. I use three, three medium potatoes. I slice them up. Okay, it's going to 375 degree oven until the cheese melts. If you use yours raw, you're going to put it in a 350 degree oven until your potatoes cook. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, it's ready. The scalloped potatoes, I'll dip up some. Easy. Okay, so they're, they're good, y'all. I want to thank you for watching my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And after watching this video, you like it, give my thumbs up. Okay, see y'all next time. Bye bye.